Dutch, Mo, what the fuck are we gonna do with oh, you? Oh, the instant noodles really hit the spot. You know, the rainy season's just about here. Isn't it a little early? Once it starts, it'll be raining every night. We'll have to keep a constant eye on the midnight channel. Can we not think Crap, about work? I didn't even think of that. Well, so it goes. <laughs> I thought you were worried about the rain because of the school camp out. Why are you so excited about that? That's right, it's the first time for you two. You realize the only purpose of the school camp out is to develop a love for one's hometown and young people, right? Yeah, they tell us that up front, so? Well, you see, the way we supposedly develop that love is by picking up trash off the mountain. Picking up trash? Develop a love my ass. That's slave labor. Well, the night's kind of fun. We cook our own meals with mess kits and sleep in tents. The four of us are in the same group. The same group, huh? Does that mean we sleep together at night, too? Stop being a perv. You wish! Guys and girls sleep in different tents. I'm warning you. If you leave your tent at night, you'll be expelled on the spot. And this gets worse and worse. I thought it was going to be fun. It's only for one night, and we disband before noon the next day. It doesn't last very long. Oh, we did have some fun at the river before going home last year. Do they let you go swimming? I think so. There's always someone who takes a dip, although we didn't. I see. So you can swim in the river. Don't punch him right in his face. Don't punch uh, wait. him. wait! Yeah, I'll do it. Oh no, King Overbite is sending me to help. Make sure you note down what he's saying here. Well, yes. That would be Kaito from Santo. months uh well, yeah can't come in two months and for giving the correct information we can get no leg expression
Hello, new social link eventually. Nishi. I did not know Saki. Vaguely speaking, also nice to meet you too. I mean, I get the very distinct feeling that if I tell you to clean, you're just not gonna anyway, so sure, fine, fuck off. Make sure you pick up a priestess persona if you don't have one already before ending today. We're not going to rank up with Nanako yet, but we will go on ahead and hang out with her. I can die. Balance beam. Bonus points. Expression. Hey, guess what I just heard? Penis. When they're sitting in back of you, it's like a squeeze play. Guess, guess, huh? Guide? There is no option for tell me more. I guess the closest would be, what are you talking about? Come on, you know what I mean? Sorry, I got ahead of myself. What I mean is... I'm talking about how when there's a girl sitting behind you on a motorcycle, they press right up against your back! Motorcycle, huh? Man, you're a lot thicker than I thought. Anyway, I think motorcycles are the hot new thing for guys now. Girls like guys who spend time outdoors, right? So I got you this. Want to get your license with me, partner? Well, I can't afford anything bigger than a scooter on my budget, but at least that'll let us get to new places. Don't you think we deserve that much seeing as how we're investigating the case? Yeah, true enough. Sup, senpai? Hey, about the camping trip, you guys busy right now? Kinda. 
We're talking about motorcycles. Motorcycles? You gonna go stomp a gang? If you're bringing a war, I'll help. No, we're not bringing a war. What does that mean, anyway? We're just talking about getting motorcycle licenses. Licenses? You guys don't have yours? Huh? No way. Don't tell me you already... Nah, I'm still 15 and all. Then why'd you say it like that? Man, that reminds me. I'm surprised you picked a fight with that biker gang. How'd you chase after them? Eh, a bike's all I need for that. <laughs> Impressive. In any case, we can't let you in on our up-close-and-personal plan. Up-close-and-personal? What does that mean? Keep it down. Like I was telling this guy, what a guy needs nowadays to be a big man is first a motorcycle, and then... And then... A girlfriend. Oh, there's the tell me more. Now that's my partner. All right, then. You guys gonna get licensed for the big stuff? I mean, I know I came in late here, but if you're talking about taking a girl on a bike, you gotta be seating too, man. That ain't allowed on a scooter. I forgot about that. Shut up, this'll work out. As long as we have a motorcycle, the girls will come running. That's all the advantage we'll need. Now listen carefully. The reason we don't have girlfriends is because we're stuck here in this town waiting to meet someone. This place is so tiny, it's no wonder we can't find one. It doesn't matter if it's only a scooter. Some kind of motorcycle is just the ticket for us to get some chicks. Then, later on, we can get a bigger motorcycle. And that's when the up close and personal plan really starts. Up close and personal. Plus, you know, you and me have more of a city boy thing going on. If we're serious about this, we've got to expand our horizons to a bigger town. We got to take the initiative. There's no time to wait for a train that only leaves every so often each day. We'll roar up on our motorcycles like the badasses we are, and when the chicks come up, we'll play it cool. The pheromones dripping off of us will bring them around in no time. What, fe feral zone? You sound like an incel, no, Yosuke. Come on. we're not going to a cat house, you idiot. I'm talking about pheromones. My research shows that a motorcycle is the number one surefire way to increase a man's pheromones. Pheromones? Don't say it like that. Dude, that's how a perv would react. What did you say? Fine, then I'm in too. Get ready for Kanji Tatsumi to show his manhood to these chicks. I already told you, you can't. Anyway, don't tell anyone about this, got it? If other guys try to copy us, it'll end up diluting our pheromones. So, partner, make sure you talk to your uncle about getting a license, okay? Got it. Not you. I don't even know your uncle. I'm serious about this. If we have motorcycles, we can go all over. It'll be fun! I'll talk to him about getting a license, but not for any feral moans or feral zones. Somewhere out there, the best days of our youth are ahead of us. I'll yeah, do I'm it. I'm with you on that one. For the fish. And that's not a euphemism. Because honestly speaking, if I'm going to feed that excessively hungry cat... Oh, hey, you've got a new mission. Uh, then I'm going to need to get access to a different fishing hole. Oh yeah, I just saw her. Sure. Crooked Cross. Or do you pronounce it crooked? I don't know. Crooked just sounds weird to me. But I have heard more than my fair share of people pronounce it as crooked instead of crooked. To the point where it does kind of make me think that there is, uh, that that's how it's supposed to be pronounced. But it just, it just sounds weird. Uh, 
Anyways, I'm gonna go looking around for uh, a couple potential jackasses blocking my movement. Uh, let's see if there's any other. Oh, hey, it's you. What are we doing today? After school is going to be Aya. Yeah. So, anyways, look around for some uh, potential fucking, what's it called? <sighs> Side quests. Kanji! Yeah, I've already accepted that. And, okay, nothing new. Into town. Shopping district. Creepy attendant. And save scum for some knowledge, courage, and diligence this time. Understanding, so already a reset. Oh, my diligence will be going up to strong soon. Nice. Back in a minute. Finally, Jesus, 20 minutes later, finally got knowledge, courage, diligence. I'm coming back here instead of when I normally would to show knowledge is increasing to professor, courage, and diligence. Increases the strong. So I am really far ahead on both knowledge and diligence as the guide is uh, not indicating either should be going up. Ah, you're back. I am. Hi there. Hi. Want some meal too? Fair warning, it's from the supermarket. Well, excuse me. Don't buy the hand that feeds it's my delicious, dude. It's delicious, though. I can't believe it was on sale. Sorry, but this guy eats instant noodles every day. That constant slurping got on my nerves, so I called him here. You don't have to bluff like that. You just wanted to eat dinner with a coworker, right? Don't be stupid. But eel was a great choice. Nanako-chan loved it, at least. I'd say she's eely proud of her daddy. Huh? 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 You have my permission to Did shoot him. Did my joke him. slip away? It is an eel, after all. Just eat your dinner. Double tap, please. Y yes, sir. Nanako-chan's such a good girl, though. She went straight to do her homework once her plate was clean. It's not every day you get to eat eel. You'd think she would have spent some more time savoring it. You think that because you slack off too much. You should follow her example. <clears throat> Way to hit where it hurts. What's the matter? Oh yeah, I'd like to learn how to drive. A motorcycle? You mean a scooter? Oh, that's right. Kids your age can ride those. Uh, I don't know, though. Come on, don't be a spoil sport. It's no surprise he wants one out here. I understand how you feel since I'm from the city myself. The trains don't run that often, and walking around everywhere is pretty inconvenient, isn't it? It is a bit of a hassle, yeah. Right? It's criminal. You say that, but... That reminds me, I remember you telling me something once, Dojima-san. About some of the reckless things you did on your motorcycle when you were young. You moron. Think before you talk. And once you're done eating, hurry and... Ugh. It's me. Hmm. All right. We'll be there soon. Looks like I made the right choice to skip the booze. Adachi, you were the one in charge of that file, right? File? Oh, did that suspicious guy show up again? Would you keep your mouth shut? We're going back. Get in the car. Back? 
You mean to the station? But I haven't had my eel liver soup yet. About this license, did you decide on this yourself? No one talked you into it. I know it's hard without a way to get around, but two-wheeled vehicles can be dangerous. Do you understand? Okay. Hear me out on this one. Two-wheeled vehicles, yes, can be dangerous if you don't know what you're doing. But more often than not, they're dangerous because of other drivers. And what I mean by that is... Other drivers barely pay attention to the road. They fucking autopilot, and it's ridiculous. I have lost count of how many times I have been almost splattered on the pavement while riding a bicycle. Or, e hell, even just crossing the street on foot at the designated crosswalks, because I'm OCD like that and every time i see somebody cross anywhere other than designated i wonder why the fuck they aren't going five feet down the street to cross there where it's substantially well minorly safer i should say because again lost count of how many times i've almost been splattered into the pavement because jackasses aren't paying attention i'll be careful with it i do want you to trust me though it's not that i doubt you but allowing you to get one is something else. Don't give me that face. I know you're serious about this. First, you need a license. We can talk about this again when you have one. Well then, sorry to dump this on you, but I need you to look after the house. On it. Of course it's Josuke. Yo, it's me. How did it go with your uncle? I've been on the edge of my seat thinking about it. Seriously? Then let's go get ours as soon as we can. Yosuke. I gotta hit the books. Let's make sure we both pass together. Yosuke, you need to put your boner away. It's char it's starting to become an issue. Well, we'll see y'all tomorrow.